Hello, this is the other guy, and welcome to Penumbrum Overture. Now, last time, uh, last time I was here, I smashed this rock, I think. Alright, that is not helpful. Um, last time I was here, Tunnels mean better not stick around long. I kind of got to, so. Okay. Last time we were here. Yep, there's Kaven. I had to, uh. Cliff notes. I had to Google it. Because I couldn't figure out what the answer was. And, uh, I'm probably gonna die quite a few times on this, because it's kind of horribly unclear as to what the answer is at any given time. Um, okay, that's death. Let's keep swinging the thing, because... Alright, let's just flee, I guess. But it hit me that time, so... Alright, it's just hitting me in the back repeatedly. Um, cliff notes, it seems very unclear as to what I'm supposed to be doing half the time. Uh, currently, from what I understand, I ended up googling it because I thought I had done it backwards and somehow... Oh, come on. is not very helpful at blocking the tunnel. Come on. Out of the chair. Form an actual blockade. Alright. So, what I'm supposed to do is come in here and get... Oh, that's a hard hat. Let's take that. We put it above my head and we let it fall on my head. Uh... There should be a note in here. I think. I originally thought this is something I'd like just straight up missed. Aha, here it is. Blank note. And you're like, what do you do with the blank note? Um Dehydration crack, yada yada yada. Alright, more lore stuff. Not that the lore stuff isn't interesting, just I like I'm very frustrated at this. I really don't know what I seem to be need to be doing with half this stuff. Uh. Oh. That was it. Unless my friends lie somewhere Dude's crazy. Which, we've already been over, so... Yeah. Okay. So, I now take this note back to where that crazy dude was rambling. And, uh... Take it back to where that crazy dude was rambling at. Okay, so we're right here. Alright. I think I have a general idea. And uh, there's a dog. Why wouldn't there be? I think right up here, and then straight up forward. I think I outran it, actually, because I don't get the drama music anymore, so. Yeah, I think I can just outrun the dogs. I mean, the dogs are menacing, it's just, they're not absolute terror kind of thing, they're just, I mean, they're crazed dogs in a tunnel. I feel bad for them, to be honest. Alright, so, as it turns out, you can Google this note and figure out the code, but it doesn't matter until you've, d like, solved the puzzle related to it. Because this game just doesn't care otherwise. So, yeah. Which is kind of annoying, but... You know. It's a game, what can you do? Alright, so then we take the note. Alright. Yeah. And now I got the code 1371. 
Alright, and now we can go actually and get to the main storage area. And once we're there, I don't know what happens. I honestly, I still don't know what my purpose is in this game. All I know is I inherited some books from my father and he was like, Yo, don't go to the crazy place. And I was like, I'm gonna go straight to the crazy place. Because I'm just, you know, the bastion of absolute brilliance right here. Like, just fucking uh, Einstein up in this bitch. It is great. Yeah, and I think you can very clearly tell I'm just being completely sarcastic with this shit. I don't know what the fuck this dude doing all this for. Like, why bother to show up at this snowy place? Why not just, I don't know, form a research team be like, Hey, my father left me a bunch of crazy shit, and it's all research. Put it in the Arctic, or Greenland, or wherever this is. Uh, I don't know. It's weird. Yeah, I put in that code four times. I was like, maybe I'm putting it in wrong, but no, it's the same code. Uh. Oh. Okay, so I don't know where I am now, so. Is that a dog? Oh, shit, it was a dog. Okay. Uh, alright. Let's run this way. We're taking sharp corners, because I assume dogs cannot handle turns like that. I don't know why I'm assuming that, but it seems to be working, and there's a door, and hopefully it's unlocked. The hunger is becoming rather uncomfortable here. How far away are you? You could not be far. I am held captive by a wall of stone in the northeast of the mine. As in any drama, there are many roles to be played. You must act the scientist in mixing potions, act the renegade in plots of destruction. On your travels through the tools with which you were fashioned by rescue, may discover the place of my last view. Be careful. The shiny, solid floor of water is not as solid as it seems. Poor Red was almost swallowed whole. The two fools he met who plummeted into my domain have long since departed, though not I expect from whence they came. I ate ravenously of biped meat that day, uh, but Red promises feasting only began when the men became pungent. When the stench of life had gone, and only the sweet aroma of decay remained. Alright, so he is a cannibal. I kind of figured that, but... Yeah. Right. Oh my god. Alright, well what doors are open? From what I can tell, it doesn't seem like any doors are open. Let's set that there in case I'm going to get attacked by a dog. Alright, so the incinerator, chemical storage. Let's go to chemical storage. Um... This way? Yes, this way. Alright. I think. Oh my god, every door is locked from the other side. <sighs> Alright, there we go. Ugh. This is all a pain. Okay, so. I don't know what I'm doing here either. Oh no. Gotta seal that. Oh shit. Uh. That was a boulder, yeah? Oh shit. That is the worm. Okay. Oh shit. Oh crap. Ah, dang it. Alright, I was not preparing for that to actually murder me. So, I'm gonna go ahead and stop this one here. Uh, I thought that was a, like a giant rolling boulder, boulder. I was like, why are we bothering to close that? But, yeah, I'm gonna get this done in the next episode. This has been the other guy. Um, subscribe if you want to. If not, bye.